Now when the Pajabat Tana done Kalyan Negri Selangor or PTG Selangor website. So as some of you have pointed out, PTG Selangor has changed its website look and layout. So now how to pay for your Chukai Tana or quit rent in 2024? So in this video, we will split into two parts. Part 1 is on Chukai Tana. So if you have a landed property or if individual titled, then the property tax you have to pay is the Chukai Tana. Then part 2 is on Chukai Petak. So if you own a strata titled property like a condo, apartment, townhouse or office, then the property tax you have to pay is the Chukai Petak. Before we continue, if you're looking for home decor and home improvement items, we have things you need to improve, beautify and style your living room, dining room, kitchen, bathroom, bedroom, study room, guest room, office, balcony, garden and porch. So shop now at iprofunds.com slash shop. You can also find the link below and in the description as well. So now we continue on to the tutorial. So in the home page here, under Perkhidmatan Atas Talian or Online Services, click e bayaran, but it also says here Semakan dan bayaran cukai tana dan cukai petak, which translates to check and pay quit rent. Then you'll be redirected to the e tana website. Then in the next page here, it is semakan dan bayar bil cukai tana atau petak, or in English, it is to check and pay the quit rent or parcel rent. So if you own a landed property, here you can select either the hak milik tana or the nomo account or ID hak milik. The hak milik tana is the land ownership and the account number is where you can find in your quit rent or cukai tana the bill. So under hak milik tana, fill in the daerah, bandar or pekan or mukim, jenis hak milik, nombor hak milik and then the captcha. This property information you can get in your garan or property title. If you can't remember this property information, you can just key in your nombor account or ID hak milik. This you can get it from your previous or your current cukai tana or quit rent bill. Then after you have filled in the property information, click cari to search. Here the property information will be displayed. So make sure that your ID hak milik, account status, name, address, cukai tana account number, hak milik status, Mukim or district, journey's hard milik or the type of title, nombor hard milik or title number and the lot number are correct. Then scroll down below, here you see the cukai maklumat or the tax information. So here you see how much you need to pay and the payment status. So if you haven't paid your cukai tanah, here you can follow the example in today's video. Click the green button, bayar or to pay. Then you can pay with your Visa or Mastercard or Amex card. And then you should receive a receipt proof of payment from e -tana. However, if you want to download a copy of your Chukai Tana or the Quit Rank, you can click the yellow button here, Bill Chukai, to download a copy of the document. And here how is the Bill Chukai that will look like. So after you have paid your Chukai Tana or Quit Rank, that's it for this property tax for the year. So now I'm going to show you how to pay the Chukai Petak or Quit Rank for your Strata title property. So to pay your Chukai Petak, you can select either the Hard Millage Strata or Nombo account or ID hard milik. If you select hard milik strata, fill in the daerah, panda or pekan or mukim, jenis hard milik, nombo hard milik, bangunan, tingkat, peta, and then the captcha. This property information, you can get it from your strata title. But if you can't remember your property information, you can also key in your nombo account or ID hard milik. This you can get it from your cukai peta, from the previous year or this year's cukai peta. After you have filled in the information, Click Chari to search. Here the property information will be displayed. So make sure that your ID hard milik, account status, name, address, cukai tana account number, hard milik status, mukim or district, journey's hard milik or the type of title, nombor hard milik or title number and the lot number are correct. Then scroll down below. Here you see the cukai maklumat or the tax information. So here you see how much you need to pay and the payment status. So if you haven't paid, here you can follow the example in today's video. Click the green button, bayar or to pay. Then you can pay for your cukai via FPX, Visa or Mastercard or American Express card. Then you should receive a receipt or proof of payment where you can then download on your computer or PC. But if you want to get a soft copy of your cukai petak, you can download a copy of your cukai petak or quit rent by clicking the yellow button below. And here how is the bill cukai that will look like. So after you have paid your cukai tana or quit rent, that's it for this property tax for the year. This tax has to be paid by May 31st or the 31st of May every year. You have paid your cukai tana or quit rent for your property for the year. And you also want to take note, 
If you pay your Chukai Tana or the quit rent after May 31st or in the second half of the year, you'll be charged a Tungakan or a late payment charge or penalty for the late payment. So thanks for watching and if you like and learn something from today's video, hit the like button below and subscribe to this channel to stay tuned for more in real estate, investing, finance and home and living product reviews. And see you in the next video.